over. No, 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 no. Those aren't for you. No, no. Some of them are for you, but not those ones. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Over, over, over. It's not Christmas yet. You can't open them yet. Come on, you have to wait. It's not time to open it yet. No, 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 not yet. Just in a little bit, okay? Hey, Oliver, it's Christmas. It's time to open presents. Are you ready? Oh, yes. You want to open that one? Okay, let's go. Come on, let's take it up onto the sofa. We'll take it up here. Oh, you want to open it right now on the floor? Okay. Here. Why don't, I, why don't I bring it up to the sofa? Let's bring it up to the sofa. You can open it right on your bed. You excited, Oliver? Finally, Christmas time is here. So he has been checking out these gifts. He's been super interested in them, and now he gets to open them. Oliver, want a little hamper? What's inside, Oliver? Oh my goodness. It's a Christmas sweater! Oliver, look! It's a Christmas sweater! Can we put it on you? Please! Oh no, he doesn't want to put on his Christmas sweater. He wants to go back and get more treats. Okay, so how does this work? Here's the front. Here's the back. Okay, here we go. Can you put your head in? Can you put your head in? He's like, no, no ugly Christmas sweater, please. Please, no ugly Christmas sweater. Um, okay. There we go. It's not through your leg holes, but... Uh, Interesting. <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's look for what else we have, Oliver. Okay, okay, we can open this one. Yeah, we'll bring it up here. What's inside, Oliver? Um, yeah, this Christmas sweater is a bit of a disaster, so I'm gonna take that off you, Oliver. Uh, oh, I can't get it off because you're trying to open that present. Oh no, I, I, I made such a mess. You can't, we can't see your face now. Okay, could you let go of the other present for a second? Oh, there must be something really good in there. He doesn't want to let go. Okay, looks like there's some kind of treat package in there. He's ripping the treat package open too. He hasn't even opened the whole present properly. He's already ripping straight through into the package underneath. And what is it, Oliver? Can we see what it is? It's red. It's red. Something. Something's inside. Something good. Something tasty. Wow, Oliver, those treats are going to get everywhere. You've just totally destroyed that package. Let me, can I see what it is? Can I see what it is, Oliver? No, can I see what it is? Here, could we just for a second see what it is? Oh, he's he's got it pinned down with his paws. I can't even get at it. He's like, no, you can't see what it is. Not until I've eaten all of it. It's something treats. Oh, it's beef liver treats. All right. Um, I think he's already had several. He seems to have really destroyed the bottom of his package. Um, it's proving to be a little bit tougher than a lot of treat packages are. Let me, maybe I can help you. How, how about I help you? Okay, yeah. Oh, right, oh my goodness, this, it's all crumbled. Okay, um, you can have one. Not all of them, no, 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 not all of them. No, no, you just ate four. That was four, okay. We're gonna put this away for a bit. You can have some later, I promise, okay? Okay, there, we have lots of other cool presents for you to open, Oliver. So, why don't we go find another present? I'll put this away. Stella and Chewy's beef liver treats. Okay, so Christmas is basically, he's, he's, <laughs> we had this happen last year too. So um, yeah, he finds the treats and then that is the focus of Christmas. Um, but we do have all these other presents, Oliver. Why don't we open another present? Okay, so I'll just put this away. I'll put this away and we'll come back, okay? So put it with your other treats. We'll come back for it later. Okay, let's go open another present. Come on. Come on. Right. What do you want to open next? Okay, that looks interesting. That's really big. It's a big present. What's inside? Looks like it might be a toy. Oliver, last week in our live stream, he already opened one of his presents, his first present of the year, and it was a toy, so this is a second toy to go with the first one. Uh, that was the monkey, and you can see that he's already been destroying it. Um, 
What is this, Oliver? Oh, you've only half opened it. There seems to be a little bit of fur coming out. You, you wanna, you wanna come see what it is up here? Yeah. Let's finish opening it. You want me to help you? Here, I'll grab this end. You grab that end. Oh, you're still. There's little bits of beef liver tree on his bed. That's much more important <laughs> to get the last tiny crumb of beef liver treat is much more important than opening a present that is a super cool whoa it's a llama oh my goodness Oliver look it's a llama are you excited llama I don't even know what noise llamas make do they are they like sheep ba -ba, or are they like horses nay which is it Oliver he's like doesn't really matter to me the most important thing is that there are a couple of tiny fragments of beef liver treat left on the bed that is like the most important aspect of Christmas right now. Okay, so I'm sure you will enjoy playing with this later. Oliver, you wanna see if there's anything else to open? Yeah, I think there's one more present. Actually, there's several more presents for you. There's including this really huge one, but let's open this one first. Let's see what's inside here, come on. So I know ribbons, eagle claws aren't very good with ribbons, so I might have to help him get the ribbon off. Okay, and you wanna grab a corner? Go ahead. Ah, he's really getting into it now. He's just ripping like crazy. Well, starting to rip like crazy. He's mostly just standing on it, actually. He's finding it a little bit hard to get leverage with his teeth, find a point of entry. He's crushing it from above with his whole body weight, really pinning it down. Oh, Oliver, this looks very violent. Um, I hope this is not something fragile inside. Oh wow, look at those jaws, really tearing into it. Uh, Oliver, is this fragile? It seems to be some kind of cardboard box inside. Is there more treats in there? Is this another package of biscuits or something? What is it? Oliver, I'm so curious, can I see too? Well, it's definitely a cardboard box full of treats. Yes, it is, come on, let's get it out, Oliver. Oh, he's got it pinned down. I, he's like, I'm not letting you anywhere near my treats. I saw what happened to the beef liver treats. We are not gonna do a repeat performance of that fiasco, that Christmas fiasco. Okay, Oliver, you can have a couple. You can rip open the bag. See, he hasn't even really opened the present properly. He just opened one end of it to get access to the treats. He's very efficient that way. He's like, why does it matter whether all the wrapping paper is off when I can get access to the treats? Oliver, this, these treats are gonna go everywhere. I mean, it's, this is, I think the messiest I've ever seen you open a present. It's just little fragments of everything. Biscuits and wrapping paper and cardboard and ribbon. Oh my goodness, and the, the, these biscuits, I don't even know what they are because I haven't seen the label. They seem to be some kind of gingerbread men. Some of them are already missing legs. You've already managed to de-leg a couple of them. All right, well. This is gonna be very tasty later, Oliver, but we do have other presents to open, so we will be we will come back to these. And he's checking to see if there's oh yeah, I left a couple cookies behind. That's good. I don't mind if you have it just a few, that's not a problem. Let's just get these little destroyed bits of paper away clean up our area to get ready for the next present opening experience. Okay, Oliver, what do we have over here? It is huge, it's so big. It's amazing, it's the biggest present you've ever gotten. Oliver, are you excited? He's like, no, actually I prefer things that come in small packages, like treat packages, that's what I like the best. Clearly, I'm gonna have to get started on this one. Do you want me to get started, Oliver? While you are licking the little fragments of uh, some kind of gingerbread man cookie. Hopefully not made out of actual gingerbread, because I don't know if that's really good for dogs. Uh, but I'm sure that uh, Daddy Wayne has bought you a very pet-friendly version. Okay, Oliver, hey, look, 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 over here. It's huge, you wanna help me with it? You wanna help me with it? He's like, no, it's actually so big, it's kind of scary. <laughs> okay, you wanna come back? No, he's like, I have never seen a present this big, and for me, it just doesn't seem like a present because it's so large. And we'll do some bargaining, okay? So for those of you with children, you probably know the whole concept of Christmas bargaining. So I'm giving him something he likes in order to get him to open something that he doesn't seem all that excited about. So here's the Christmas bargain. You get a little bit of this. 
Okay, it's a beef liver treat. And now we open this. Okay. Look, Oliver. It's a Casper bed. Well, actually, Oliver fans, this was a Casper bed, and, and we did make it, and he does have a new bed for Christmas, but we also used it to package something else. We used the packaging to make some, to, because he has a second large present this year. Oh, and he's off to the beef liver treats again. Oliver, come on. Hey, hey, hey. Can I have your attention, please? Oliver, there's so much good stuff, so much fun stuff over here. Oh yes, yes, that's great, she likes it. Okay, come on, let's see what's in this package. Okay, what's this? What's in this package? Oh, he's tentatively interested, potentially interested. He thinks, well, there could be treats in that package that big. I've never had that experience, but it doesn't mean it can't happen. Uh, okay, I don't, I didn't package this myself, but uh, I don't think that this is all. I actually, We'll need some help putting this together. It is some kind of tent for Oliver. And I believe that the tent goes like this, and then this is a, wow, Oliver, it's like your own little nest, and it has your name on it. Oliver, you wanna come into your nest? And there must be some, uh, some holes for it somewhere. We will put all that together in a little bit. First, we have to go and Convince Oliver that Christmas is not just about beef liver treats. No, no, it's not just about beef liver treats. It's about peace and love and goodwill to all men. Oliver, do you want to go sit down and tell the Christmas story with me? So, thank you everyone. We were actually supposed to start with wishing you happy holidays. And for those of you who celebrate Christmas, happy Christmas. Um, but Oliver got so into his presents that we're gonna do this now more at the end. So to all of our fans all over the world, we hope you are having a wonderful time today with your families if possible. And yeah, Oliver is super excited about, about all his gifts. So Oliver, we have one more amazing gift for you, which is the Casper bed, which we have already opened and already made. And we're a little bit sad. Oh, there is this one too. Oliver's like, I am absolutely certain there's one more present for me. So Oliver, these, these are some cookies that we thought you might want to share with Santa, but you know, I think you're probably more into having them yourself. Okay, so we will also um, open this little bag of cookies later, Oliver, okay? Because you've already had quite a lot of biscuits, okay? But first we're gonna do the Casper bed, okay? How's that sound? I'll give you, how about I give you another beef? Let's do a little more Christmas bargaining. I'll give you a little bit more of the beef liver tree. And then you'll get the Casper bed. Okay, so here we go. Yes, Merry Christmas, Oliver. So you can see his old Casper bed is here. It's five years old. You might remember there was a video called New Year, New Bed. When we got this bed, he, out, he had a smaller Casper bed, but he outgrew it. And it's a little bit tattered. Five years of Oliver lying on it, scratching on it. He often brings treats here and then eats them. Like for example, this would be a common Oliver experience. There's a treat there. He'll eat it and he'll eat the fragments and he'll scratch at it and chew on it. And you can see that, you know, it gets a little bit damaged. But now, Oliver, I have something for you. It is amazing. Oliver, look, 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 Oliver. It's a new Casper bed. And I have to say, Oliver fans, we are not actually sponsored by Casper. We just really like their beds. And, um, they are super comfortable and that's actually pretty durable that it lasted five years. And for those of you um, with sentimental attachment to Oliver's puppy things, I have a huge sentimental attachment to them. We will not be throwing this bed out. We will put it in another room where he can still lie on it when he wants to. But this is Oliver, this is gonna be your main bed now. And we're gonna put it right here. Yes, it's your new main bed. What do you think? He's like, well, if there was a beef liver treat involved, I might be more excited about it. Okay, back to the bribery one more time. Here we go. Oliver, you want to try going into your tent? You want to try going in? Especially when there's a beef liver treat involved? So this tent, Oliver fans, we got it on uh, from Etsy. 
And we're hoping that he will love just the feeling of being enclosed and safe and comfortable. It's a super comfortable pillow. And yeah, there are no more beef liver treats in there and neither in my hands, Oliver. But you should go in and check. Yeah. What do you think, Oliver? You think you want to settle down in there? It's really nice fabric. And of course it has Oliver's name right at the top. This might take him some convincing, getting used to it. Getting used to the concept of sleeping or lying in a bed. That's a great idea, don't you think, Oliver? Mm. <laughs> He's like, where do the rest of those treats go? Uh, yes. Maybe at some point he'll settle down in there. Oh, 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 almost all the paws. Three paws are in. What about the fourth paw, Oliver? You could do it. Get all the way on that pillow. No. No, now we're just back to two paws inside. There he goes, he's in all four paws. All four paws are in. All right, good job. Good job, Oliver, you did it. You went in your tent. Okay, so Oliver has turned basically into a reindeer wearing a Christmas sweater. And we have had a wonderful Christmas here opening his presents. There's still lots more fun to come. Uh, we hope you're all gonna join us for more videos in 2022. And thanks everyone all over the world. Okay, so the antlers have just become a bib. A Christmas bib. Oh, you do that every year. Yeah, that's where the liver treats went. He's like, that's where all the good stuff is. Mm. Okay, one more treat, Oliver. <laughs> then it's time to say goodbye to our fans. Here we go. Say goodbye, Oliver. Oliver's like, there's always one treat left in the bag. Oh.